very recently I went to my eye doctor and he said your vision is not perfect it's not six by six and he advised me glasses and whoa the world was different the world was clear and yes now I had six by six vision but we use this very commonly right what exactly this six by six mean and that's the question we are trying to answer today what actually is six by six vision Welcome to this another milestone in human eye and the colorful world, grade 10th. Let's answer what is 6 by 6 vision. Alright, so we are seeing this amazing world through our eyes. Very, very important sensory organs. We have also discussed previously about what myths, you know, we know about how your eyes can be affected, which actually it's not true, right? But we should take good care of our eyes because these are really, really important. But sometimes, sometimes due to certain factors, these eyes get affected. And when you go to a doctor, they tell you your vision is not perfect. You need assistance in terms of you need spectacles or lenses, right? And that's why these glasses, right? So they always somehow end up giving this statement. Your vision is not six by six. Hmm. Let me just see what I can do. Let me check your eyes and prescribe some spectacles for you. 6 by 6 because this thing is again and again and again coming in our life so let's understand this what does 6 by 6 mean and let me tell you it's not something very difficult it actually means 6 meters by 6 meters what exactly does this mean it's okay don't worry let me tell you 6 meters distance which you can see the numerator the numerator 6 meters is the distance which you are able to see perfectly and the denominator uh, 6 meters is the distance an average or a healthy vision can see perfectly. Alright, so numerator is something which you are able to see perfectly. Denominator is something which a healthy or an average person is able to see perfectly. Okay, nice. Alright. But uh, does 6 by 6 mean perfect vision? No. This is more like an average vision. Is it possible to have something more than 6 by 6 or like 9 by 6? Yes, let's think about it. If, let's say, an average person is able to read something at a distance of 4 meters. Nice, means this is the denominator. Fine, my denominator is fixed, 4. But when you were there, at 4 you were able to read it. But when you moved away, you went till 6 meters, you were still able to read it. Oh, nice, better than average vision you have. You are able to read at 6, numerator becomes 6. So the vision becomes 6 by 4, more than 1, correct? You have a better than average vision, alright? Now, if next case, let's say you are, uh, let's say an average person or a healthy eye is able to read something at 12 meters, right? This is the denominator, but you at 12 meters were not able to read it. You had to move closer and when you moved closer, you were able to read at 6 meters. Ah, so numerator becomes 6 where you can read. Denominator is 12, where the average person can read. 6 by 12, it is a below average vision. And that's why we need help, all right? Now, we all have seen this chart. Whenever you go for an eye test, this is our nemesis. You know? It feels so bad. Uh, doctor, I can't read below the third line. You know? This is what we used to do. So that's what happens, right? So this is called as Snellen eye chart. Each line is actually predetermined to be something which an average eye can see. If you can't see below that line, means your vision is that number. What do you mean? Let me tell you. If let's say you cannot read below this line, LPED, you read this nicely, but below this you were not able to read properly. You know what? This is already predetermined that average eye can see or can read this line from a distance of 15 meters but you are actually able to read it at 6 meters because 6 meters is the rough distance the doctor keeps you from this chart right so 6 meters is something which doctor has already fixed for you now each line is something which a healthy eye can see from what distance is given to you already so 15, 15 meters is the distance an average eye can see this from 6 meters is what you are seeing it right now let's say this green one Average eye can read this from 9 meters, but you are able to read it at 6 meters. This red line, average eye can read it at 6 meters. You, my friend, are also able to read 6 meters. Nice. Does it mean you have perfect vision? You all, you know this till now, right? 
No, it means you have a good enough, an average vision. Sir, can I read it more? The, the below letters, yes, if you are able to read it, you might have more than, more than 6 by 6 vision, right? You might have 9 by 6 vision, possible, right? So that's what we need to do, we need to talk about, right? 6 by 6 is clear, nice. But sometimes, sometimes, at least in international forums or if you're, if you're a friend, they might tell you, you know what, I have a 20 by 20 vision, why? Because US tucks in feet, they use feet. So that's why their chart looks like this. Where you have 6 by 6, they have 20 feet by 20 feet, right? 20 feet by 20 feet. So that's why, nothing special, everything, the concept remains same. Only the unit is changed. Yours is 6 meter by 6 meter, theirs is 20 feet by 20 feet. That's it, that's the only difference, right? So I think now you got it, right? What 6 by 6 means. Never be confused, it's the average vision. You can have more than this, you can have less than this. If you have less, you need help. If you have more, be happy. Take good care of your eyes. Let me ask you something then. If someone has 6 by 12 vision, which defect of vision do they have? Tell me in the comment section below and stay tuned for more such amazing information and sessions on this particular channel. Subscribe and watch.